Have you ever imagined what it is like to control your computer or phone telepathically? Or search a topic or subject with the use of your brain and AI? Elon Musk and Neuralink are here to show us the future of humanity. Today at Finance Per, we'll learn about the development and the power of neural links. But before that, click that subscribe button for more videos about finance, technology, and business. Neuralink was founded in 2016 by Elon Musk and a founding team of seven scientists and engineers. The group consists of experts in areas such as neuroscience, biochemistry, and robotics. As their mission states, create a generalized brain interface to restore autonomy to those with unmet medical needs today and unlock human potential tomorrow. But what is Neuralink? Neuralink is a neurotechnology that aims to develop implantable brain machines interfaces, or BMIs. Now, these interfaces connect the human brain with external devices, such as computers or smartphones, to enhance mental abilities and enable a symbiotic relationship with artificial intelligence. Neuralink's main goal is to create high bandwidth low latency communication between the brain and external devices like computers to open up possibilities for treating neurological disorders, restoring sensory functions, and ultimately achieving a form of human AI integration called transhumanism. Musk stated that he was inspired by the science fiction concept of Neuralace from the novel series The Culture. Musk defined the neural lace as a sort of digital layer above the cortex that would not necessarily require extensive surgical insertion, but it is ideally implanted through a vein or an artery. He also said that its long-term goal is to integrate the brain with AI, which he also perceives as an existential threat to humanity if it goes unchecked. He stated that the device would be like something analogous to a video game, like a saved game situation where you are able to resume and upload your last state, and address brain injuries or spinal injuries and make up for whatever lost capacity somebody has with a chip. So how does Neuralink work? Neuralink is mainly composed of the probe. The probes are made of polyamide or a biocompatible material with a thin gold or platinum conductor. It is then inserted into the brain through surgery. Each probe consists of 48 or 96 wires that contain electrodes capable of locating signals in the brain. It also contains a wire that interacts with an electronic system that allows the amplification and acquisition of the brain signal. The probes will then be inserted into the brain through robotic surgery. The company stated that they've engineered a surgical robot capable of inserting many flexible probes into the brain, which can avoid tissue damage and longevity issues associated with larger and more rigid probes. The robot has an insertion head with a 40 micron diameter needle made of tungsten designed to attach to the insertion loops inject individual probes, and penetrate the brain with six wires per minute. Would you like to have your own Neuralink? I want to know your comments down below. But if you are interested in more videos about finance, technology, and business, don't forget to click that like button and subscribe to our channel. Although Musk stated that it will begin human experiments in 2020, it was later pushed to 2023. And as of May 2023, the experiments have been approved in the United States. But how effective is the technology? In April 2021, Neuralink demonstrated a monkey playing the game of Pong using the Neuralink implant. While similar technology existed before, this was revolutionary in making the implant wireless and increasing the number of implanted electrodes. This also raises flags in groups such as PETA due to Neuralink's test in surgically implanting them into the brains of animals. Out of 23 monkeys experimented on by Neuralink, 15 died or were euthanized as a result of the experiments. 
Although the causes are still unknown, it was leaked that Musk was in demand for fast results, leading to the needless death of the animals. FDA approved the human trials in May 2023, although it was previously rejected in 2022, citing major safety concerns involving the device's lithium battery, the potential for the implant's tiny wires to migrate to other areas of the brain and questions over whether and how the device can be removed without damaging brain tissue. Although Neuralink did not address this, they continued with the trials. Neuralink is currently seeking participants with conditions including paralysis, blindness, deafness, or the inability to speak as they aim to cure mental and brain problems first. FDA also confirmed that Neuralink was only approved for an Investigational Device Exemption or IDE. This is the FDA process that allows a device to be used for clinical studies. Although we are still awaiting results from the trials, we can only expect that it may be the solution to humanity's greatest problem, or maybe just another botched human experiment. But if you are interested in how Nike dominated the sports industry or the awaited Apple Vision Pro and its capabilities, check out our channel for more amazing videos about finance stories, new technologies, and business tips and ideas. If you like this video, please click that like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click that notify bell for upcoming videos. But for now, this is Finance Burr. Have a great day.